this is Ekalpana here. In this video, we are going to solve a simple problem from solvable copy. So let's get started. Problem: Solve p square minus tan p plus 12 equals to zero. Solution: Given differential equation p square minus tan p. Plus 12 equals to 0. Then p square minus split this minus 7p as 3p and minus 4p. Minus 3p and minus 4p. Okay. The ter third term will be as it is plus 12 equals to 0. Then now take p common from the first two terms, we'll get p times p minus 3. And take Minus 4 common from the next two terms. So you get minus 4 times P minus 3 equals to 0. Minus 4 into P is minus 4P. Minus into minus plus 4 3 is a 12. Okay. Since you are having P minus 3 in both the terms. So take P minus 3 common from these terms. Then you get P minus 3 times P minus 4 equals to 0. Then p minus 3 equals to 0 and p minus 4 equals to 0. Now we are having p minus 3 equals to 0 and p minus 4 equals to 0. So let's consider the first equation p minus 3 equals to 0. Okay. You can write this as p equals to 3. Now put p equals to dy by dx. Then dy by dx equals to 3. Then dy equals to 3 times dx or 3 into dx whatever. Now perform integration. Integral dy equals to 3 into integral dx. Then integral dy is y equals to 3 into integral dx is x. Plus integral constant c. Again, you can write this as y minus 3x minus c equals to 0, which is solution for the first differential equation. Okay? 3 minus, sorry, y minus 3x minus c equals to 0 is solution to p minus 3 equals to 0. Now consider the second one. p minus 4 equals to 0. You can write this as p equals to 4. Now put p equals to dy by dx. Then dy by dx equals to 4. Then dy equals to 4 into dx. Now perform integration. Integral dy equals to 4 into integral dx. Then integral dy is y equals to 4 into integral dx is x plus integral constant c. Then y minus 4x minus c equals to 0, right? So, this is a solution to this equation, okay? y minus 4x minus c equals to 0 is solution to p minus 4 equals to 0, okay? Now, these two solutions, that is a combined form of these two solutions will be the required solution for the given differential equation therefore y minus 3x minus c into y minus 4x minus c equals to 0 is the required solution okay it's really simple right so we have seen a problem from solvable copy in this video hope you will understand we'll see you in the next video until then Bye-bye.